Hey everyone, welcome back. Guess what? I fixed the noise. It was in my mixer. I had to blow on a couple of contacts, and I don't know why it was those contacts that were making noise. Anyway, what the hell was I doing? Like midnight, I just got off the phone with my old drummer. He called me just to kind of shoot the breeze, you know. And Anyway. I forget. That is so annoying. Okay. Okay, you want that on? Yes. that off. Yes. Blue, green, green. That's right. <coughs> Looking for the junkyard? Is that it? I should have just looked up where the junkyard is while I was off screen. I'm going to do that. Just a second. Whoops. You know, the guides for this game are horrible. They are just bad. It just says, go back to the junkyard. I searched for junkyard, and that's all it said. Just go back to the junkyard. I don't know where the junkyard is, so I'm guessing it's back here somewhere. Because I honestly have no freaking clue. But I would imagine where we came in was the junkyard. So let's save state right there. I don't think I got hit by those at all last time. And what happens as soon as I get here? Bam! Spiked in the face. Okay, I think that's where I need to be. Yep, there we go. Okay. <laughs> That's it, huh? Save right there. I guess we're going this way.
looks kind of goofy. Where's Ken? It's not doing crap to him. Let's try particle bombs. Yeah, that did crap as well. Alright, that's more like it. be the bombs taking damage when they explode that's causing that. Uh -oh. Maybe not.
Oh. Well, that's interesting. I see a raptor in there. Okay, let's cast that barrier spell. And... I want my bazooka. 40 of those, 30 of those. Alright, let's 
see what we got now. Oh, the blue thingy. Holy crap, there's like three of them. That's not gonna do much, is it? Nope. I'm gonna swap out my ammo. These particle bombs again. I think I'd like to save the super strong stuff for that little cleaning robot when he comes back. Of course, barriers run off, and now they're all gonna swap. these things move. I haven't killed one of you guys yet? Come on. Alright, I have a barrier. Super heal. Oh crap. Okay, there he goes. What is that? Death spider. Holy crap. Two horse cannons. What do I do? What do I do? Ow! Heck no, put that barrier back on. Crimineetly. 
lot of health much? I didn't want to check that. Oh, come on. On, I can't get shots back. Horse cannon died. Holy crap. When did that happen? This is just like hecticness. What the hell is that? Where did you come from? Barrier quick. And then I can charge. Horse cannon's almost dead again. You're getting a barrier too, buddy. How did you die? I gave you a barrier. Cannon. He's alive. Okay. Barrier multiple. 
energize or scan it. Target Carlton's robot. This is just madness. I don't even know what's going on anymore. I like that damage, but holy crap. for this filthy human. Barrier has worn off. Not so fast, metal head. Barrier has worn off. No losing power. Barrier has worn off. Carlton has left the building. Energize has worn off. It looks like his insidious villain days are over. So, Professor... What's gonna happen to Evermore now? Hmm, that's a good question. I'm not sure. It was Carlton's influence that created the evil elements on Evermore. Now that he's unplugged, I would suspect that those elements should be going away. You could take a look for yourself. I'll virtually put you into the scene with my projectomatic Zapatron thingy. Let me see, twist this knob, pull this lever. Yes, that should do it. My lord. I'm a virtual boy. I'm watching things that I don't know what they are explode. What's going to happen to the boat guy? The ferryman? Charon? Karen? Whatever you want to call him? <clears throat> I remember this area. It's where I grinded all my weapon levels. Holy crap, what was that? I'm a real boy! Whoa, it looks like the big monster scene in Monster Quake, or the big battle scene in Monster Quake down there. Yes, I believe that Evermore is on a collision course for destruction. That's bad. You are Dr. Wily. With Carlton's influence gone, the balance of the world is completely offset. Uh-oh. What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? The only way to reverse the problem is to remove our own influence on the world. We have to leave now and take our friends with us. Or evermore will be nevermore forevermore. Oh. You sure you're not Dr. Wily? Well, let's do something about it, man. Come on. We're just walking here. Don't pat the TV. Oh, this is not good. Well, if we have to leave, let's leave. Come on. Things are getting much worse. Okay, let's go. Come on, let's leave. I don't know if this old space station can handle it. All right, so let's go. You've got to go down there. We've got to find Elizabeth, Horus, and Camellia and bring them here. Then we'll return to Podunk together. It's the only hope for Evermore and for us. We'll do it. Uh, what do you suppose our chances are? Let's see, integrate this function, differentiate that result. Mm take an eyeing vector here, invert it, here the three. The chances for success are roughly zip. But you've got a something, let's go horse cannon, we've got to go get our friends. All right, finally, let's go get them. Do I have to go do it or is the game gonna, okay. Putting down my controller now. raining and the fire's still burning. <clears throat> I 
I don't know what's happening. If the quakes get worse, the village is doomed. The quakes have never been this bad. I fear you might be right. I have a bazooka. Elizabeth, you've got to come with us. Evermore is coming apart, and we're the cause. Strongheart, I must leave, but I'd like to thank you and the whole village. You've all been so kind to me. These ground shakes are getting worse, and I'm afraid that's because of me. Fire eyes, Elizabeth, don't talk like this. The ground has shaken before. It's not your fault. <coughs> I'm afraid it is, dear friend, and things will only get worse if I stay. Elizabeth, are you ready to go? Yes, in just a moment. Then no. Sniff, Strongheart, sniff. I didn't think it would be so hard. I know, little one, I know. But you should go now. Your future is out there, not here. You will always have a home here, Fire Eyes. All right, let's go. Let's go. Come on. Bad stuff going down. Why did I run towards the house? Okay, we're gonna have to watch everybody get on the boat, and then after everybody get off, take off the boat. Nobody's gonna mess with our escape pod over here, huh? I believe these quakes are getting worse. I think you're right, my friend. The people haven't started the panic yet. But if things don't improve, they'll soon be chaos. Chaos, I say! Chaos is a moose. Horus! Horus! Zalons, lad! Take your time now. What is it? Evermore is coming apart. We've got to leave. Leave? We should stay and help these people. But where are the problem? We don't belong here anymore. The longer we stay, the worse it will get. Horace, if the boy is right, you should leave immediately. Don't worry, I can take care of things here. I know you can, my friend. You're a good man, Madronius. As are you, Horace Highwater, and it has been an honor knowing you. Come on, old man. Kick your feet. Move, move, move! I will carry you. Get in the damn boat. Get in the damn boat. Alright, come on, come on. We're going, we're going, we're going. Gotta hurry, got no time for the jibba jabba. Okay, we land, and we go. It's very yellow here. Okay, you guys stay here. I'll be right back. I'm so scared. Camellia, we have to go. Evermore is shaking apart. No time to explain. Camellia, my sweet, don't leave me. You heard the boy. You can have the castle. <laughs> wow, she moves faster than Horace. Now we go to space. Now we get to go to space. Do we go to space now? To space. <coughs> Whoa! My God, it's like seizure juice. Hurry, friends. We've got to go back to Podunk. We're running out of time. Holy crap. Goodbye, Carlton. I'll see you on the other side. I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> go, go. Good lord, Horace is slow. Don't, don't, don't mind me. I'm just walking. Oh, God. Yeah, stop doing that. Where is Jason? There's not much time. I, Dr. Wiley, will escape to my skull fortress. I hope that he makes it. Oh, stop that. God, that hurts. My eyeballs. Let's go, horse cannon. Come on. Forget about the cat. We've got to go back to Podunk. Jeez, in me.
Whoa, that was intense. Hi, Horse Cannon. It's good to see that you're back to normal. Everything is normal. Good old Podunk. Nothing, blah. I wonder if that whole adventure is just a product of our overly active imaginations. Wow! <clears throat> I think we've got our answer. <sighs> well, we're safe and we're home, friends. That was a close call. It certainly was. Now the new adventure begins in this real world. It's not 1965 anymore, you know. I know that it was time to go, but I'm going to miss my village. And I will miss my kingdom. I wonder what will become of Evermore. That is a weird ass ending. So, this has been Let's Play Secret of Evermore. <laughs> I'm confused. My brain hurts, viewers. <laughs> right here, behind my right eye. Maybe it's a tumor. I think I need another drink. Where are you guys going? George Sinfield, that explains everything. No, it doesn't. Hey, good job, Jeremy. Hello, I am old. Look, this woman is standing on top of a man. <sighs> and many others. Their testers was named Conan. That's awesome. Ah, two Shakespeare's. Daniel Abraham. Information services. He answers the phones. Oh, look, there's like the four Japanese people who worked on this game. Whoa, why is that guy blue? Ooh. Special thanks to our families. From our families to yours. Thanks to me and my faithful companion, Horse Cannon. The end. Thank you guys for watching Let's Play Secret of Evermore. Galif, thank you for requesting this. I've been wanting to finish this game for years. I finally did, and... I think I had a stroke. The whole right side of my body feels funny. Now before we say goodbye, viewers, there's one thing I want to show you that I heard about forever ago. I'm not going to make you sit through the whole thing, so here's what I'm going to do. End the video, and I'll see you in a moment. After waiting for quite a while... That's a good robot, Carlton. Dust, dust, clean, clean. And no more plans for world domination. Okay. Good. Bye, Dr. Wiley. But wait, I do believe there's more. I think it takes half an hour real time. I've been holding the fast forward button. Let's 
Make a save state here and speed it up just a tad. You're a patient one, aren't you? Well, here's another cryptic credit just for you. Dolly Grip, Brian Fedrow. And that's it. That is the honest to God end of Secret of Evermore. My goodness. What a way to spend a day, viewers. <laughs> Thank you very much. I will see you all next time in Gallif's next request. Carry on.